The weigh-ins are in. 159.2 for Sergio Mora. 159.8 for Daniel Jacobs. This is going to be a great fight. It's a great middleweight bout you guys are about to see here. For the WBA World Middleweight title. Sergio Mora, 28 wins, 3 losses, 9 KOs. Daniel Jacobs, 29 wins, 1 loss, 26 KOs. You all know I love to go to their records and compare, so let's do that. I want to start off with the favorite Daniel Jacobs and see what notable names he may have on his resume. Um, to be honest, I don't really see anybody really good on Daniel, Daniel Jacobs' resume besides Giovanni Lorenzo. And he wasn't really all that, but Giovanni Lorenzo. Um, I guess a good fight with Fletcher. And um, that's about it. You know, his record didn't really have anybody too impressive on it that I thought was anybody interesting, you know. However, his record does stand 29 wins, one loss, 26 KOs. And the person he lost to was Dimitri Parak. Right? It was 16, an undefeated guy at the time. Um, so let's go to uh, Sergio Mora, who's 28 wins, three losses, two draws, nine KOs. But this guy actually fought some notable names. You know what I mean? He fought Shane Mosley and drawed with Shane Mosley. Okay? He fought Vernon Forrest and won one and lost one, but he still won one. All right, he fought Peter Manfredo Jr. and won both fights. You know, this guy right here to me is kind of underrated. You know what I mean? He has a couple of names under his belt where I say, yeah, he can fight. You know what I mean? This guy can fight. You know, he has lost to Brian Vera, but at the same time, you know, he beat Nunes. He beat he beat a couple guys. You know, he beat Abraham Han, and I think this is well deserved. You know, chance of the title, well deserved chance. Uh, Sergio Moro said he's gonna knock him out. And uh, I know it sounds weird, but I'm actually going with Sergio Mora for the win. I say Sergio Mora wins in 11th round. KO. 11th round. Oh, they're throwing a the towel for Daniel Jacobs. You know, it's going to be an all-out war. You know, I say Jacobs is a, is a KO king, and he, he, can, he can win the fight. And um, he can win the fight with his power and with his boxing skills. So Jacobs, of course, the, the favorite, of course, has a chance to win. A definitely, you know, a big chance to win because of his skills and all. And um, but uh, I I see Sergio Moro going for the upset, guys. So tune in for the fight; it'll be a great fight. Thank you for watching. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. And tell me who do you think is gonna win, and how do you think they're gonna win, and what do you think they're gonna do? Because I would like to know. You know, thank you for watching. Like, comment, share, and subscribe.